Ubo Kingdom, an island in Ilaje local government area of Ondo State, came alive on the 9th of November 2019 when the paramount ruler, His Imperial Majesty Oba Dr. Frederick and Niti Olorunda Obateru Akinruto, the Okoro Ajiga I, celebrated his 10th year on the throne of his forefathers. The circumstances surrounding his enthronement was uh, supernatural. It was a kind of a twist of a history in the kingdom of Ugoland. It's been a wonderful time looking at them, learning from them, and enjoying the cultural affairs of Ugoland. It was a roll call of royal fathers, home and abroad, captains of industries, political bigwigs, and so many other people. As a father, uh, we're being brought up very well to be patient. And as a king, he has stepped into that throne and he has not changed. I've learned to be hardworking, to be determined, to be a dogged fighter. So, by and large, uh, I want to appreciate God for his life. To mark the 10th year coronation anniversary, the monarch laid the foundation of a building for mother to child projects. Various cultural groups performed to show the rich cultural heritage of the Ubu people. The monarch, whose 10 years on the throne, has brought peace and development to his community, encouraged the youth to take Western education seriously to enable them contribute to the development of the kingdom. It is by the grace of God, not by power or might or whatever, but the Lord's spirit that has been upholding him. And for what I saw today with the crowd, I feel great, overwhelmed, happy, enjoying myself here. You could see the way I'm enjoying myself. I'm bubbly now. And I want to thank everybody, particularly the monarch. Even if I do not eat for even one month, no, no problem. <laughs> to add more spice to the celebration, Juju Maestro, King Sonny Ade, and Chief Commander Epiniza Obe entertained the guests. Long live Oba Dr. Frederick and Niti Olorunda Obateru Akiruton Okoro Ajigawan.